Mix Talent Thursday. And we had the little game show thing on there. That was pretty dope. It's your boy Speedy in the house. Want to let all the ladies know if you're in a 99 cent store and I see you, I will get at you and we'll hook up that night and I'll give you a little of this. Oh! Save a piece for me tonight because I'm hungry. I'm hungry if I put you wanna eat tonight. I do. I'm singing the real song. Are you? Wow. You like that, huh? Yo, it's your boy Speedy in the house. I'm the poetess. Yes, you are. It's your girl Claudia Jordan. EDP, Mr. One Two Three Knox, baby. Hair clips. And the phone lines are open. 323 Oh, we got a caller. <laughs> Do we? No, nah, I'm just fucking. <laughs> 1600. The phones is working. Get on them, folks. Right. ATT call. <laughs> <laughs> AT oh, we disconnected. Yeah. Um, want to say what's up to everybody in, on Team RAR, our page on Facebook, and uh, Reach Around Radio on Facebook. Yeah. Love you guys. All right. So um, I got a l little segment yeah. we're going to readdress that I've done once or twice before. And um, TDP named it um, Blunts and Beats, Blunts and Beats, Blunts and Beats, Blunts and Beats, Blunts and Beats. I hate this song. But turn, turn it up. Turn it up. Shout out to Will I Am. I remember them when they first started out as uh, the Opbound Clan on uh, Easy E's Ruthless Records. Mm. Dig that. They were called what again? Opbound. Opbound Clan. Ot yeah, you got to change that. Shit. What do you name again? Ot nah, we got to go with something real cool, dog. How about Black Eyed Peas? Mm. Okay, cool. So, Blunts and Beats, basically, we just talk about, um, you know, folks in hip-hop and, you know, just kind of shining a light on them. And so, we'll take it back today with uh ludicrous who's Luda. an award-winning rapper actor and businessman christopher bridges no ludicrous christopher ludicrous it's kind of creative well it's been about 12 years since he um stepped on the scene with his first major release back for the first time and what your fantasy took um you know the atlanta native to the top that kind of put uh ludicrous on the top Prior to becoming a rap star, he was a popular DJ on Hot 97 in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. He won Grammys, Golden Globes, and numerous other accolades. Although Ludacris is doing movies and making big business moves, rap continues to be his first love. He plans to drop a new album titled Ludiversal mm -hmm. on Stick September 11th, which happens to be his birthday and Virgo. i have a little clip of luda speaking on the importance of being a businessman and a rapper mm. it's very important for artists to be business people because if you want to last in this game the game is all about longevity man you got to know your business before you are artist otherwise you're not going to last that long you got to have your business together learning from experience is a good business tactic man but always you know you got to be prepared there's two <laughs> things to be in this world scared or prepared being prepared is just like you know, trying to get as much information on the on the subject that you're working on as possible, and that's what's up. Whether it's reading books, whether it's getting out and hollering at people that have done it before, it's about experience, man, and, and hollering at folks that have experience if you don't have it yourself. I am a businessman first. I'm a rapper second. All right, amen to that. Let's get off into a ludicrous classic. What's your fantasy? Hit us up. Yeah. You make so good, I don't want to leave. What's your fantasy, What's your fantasy, uh, 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 Speedy? Big girls. Big girls doing what? Just holding them up. What? I got it like that, man. I can hold them. Pam, I can hold you up, baby. Draw that in. <laughs> Speedy, would you really hit Pam if you, if you had the opportunity? All day, er, a day. Are you saying she's a big girl? She's big girlish. Ish. You got some big old. You got some big old. Yeah, you, got, you just gonna have no backside. Uh, you got like a long back. <laughs> <laughs> but it's sexy. <laughs> wow, Steve. <laughs> it's a sexy one. I saw her crack one day. Oh, yeah. Huh? She, she will give you a plumber's crack <laughs> once in a while. Who, Pam? Pam. Yeah, oh, I, I see it often. <laughs> Claudia will give it to you every time. She be sagging sometimes. <laughs> she get them low riders. 
<laughs> having sweats on. <laughs> I was helping to move. I was like, crack kills. <laughs> <laughs> She look at him, look at him. Oh, look, like you don't know. You don't feel that draft? <laughs> you don't feel that? You don't feel the wind beneath your wings? <laughs> Hold up, they got to turn your mic on. Code red. T uh, mic number three. No, you number three. Number three. Three. Uh, three. That's one. Three. One more. One. Yeah, you go. He's got a green. Yeah, you go. That's my word. That ain't um, it either. Just turn them all up. Shit. There you go. Shit right here. Uh, uh. Now, I just don't understand why the topic of conversation is the crack of my ass. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, Paula, this is at the time. I wasn't paying attention, but... <laughs> crack of your ass just said, hey. But you're well, right, Claudia. I did have a second, you know, with my sweats. I do. I, do. I really do. Do you need some more strings? Do you need, you need to pick <laughs> up some strings? They came out, so I wrapped it around. <laughs> you wrapped it around. <laughs> I'm going to buy you some shoelaces for Christmas. <laughs> How about some sweat? How about that? The safety pins that can like wire some one, shit. I can get she the ones from go, my mama. I got it. You, so you ain't going to buy your girl a, a whole sweatsuit? I'm saying it's a recession. <laughs> what size you wear? What size are you? Um, like a 12. 12. So I can't go to Flavor 21? 12, 13, huh? <laughs> no. Yeah, they have 12. Uh-huh. No. Yes, they do. Yeah, Not they have they yes, have they plus sizes I go there, there all the time. In Flavor 21? Yeah. I, w I went shopping I there to Speed Speed in action. Weekend. Gotta get you some Capri pants. <laughs> <laughs> we have some calls, you guys. We got Jay Scholar from South Carolina. Welcome to the show. Jay, what's up, dog? What's going on, big dog? Cold chilling. Hey, hey. What's up, man? Hey, Dilly, what you doing this time what? of night, man? Um, I'm, I just got finished doing some designs, and um, I'm actually rolling up. And uh, I want y'all to still do the, uh, you know, hey, so and so. That that's hilarious. But I didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you missed that. that. Okay. Okay. okay, let's do it right, y'all. Ready? All right, let's go. Uh, who we got on the phone? Who we got on the phone? What's your name? Where are you calling from? Jay Scholar from South Carolina. Hey, hey Jay Scholar. Scholar. <laughs> uh, I need to drop the weed. I've been listening to y'all since the Fox Hole, man. Thank you, man. Uh, now our mic's on pops, so we can do it. Yeah. Thank you, Jay. Yeah. We appreciate the support. I, I always say all the time, I love Team RAR. You guys are the coolest. I don't really like to call you fans, you know what I mean? Because I, I, I consider you, nah, all I, of us I a team. you and Claudia all the time on Twitter. Yeah, we do. And uh, DJ Always. Always actually sent me some music one time. That's right. Yeah, that's Jay, why we call it Team R.A.R. You need that money, too, for that music, pimp. Don't get that shit <laughs> free. <laughs> Jay is very supportive on like Facebook, Twitter, everything. Yes. So How's we weather? appreciate yeah. it. How's yeah, the weather? Claudia's so real, real mad cool. Man. And I don't know what y'all talking about. I don't know why. I, like, I just caught the, just came in, like, 20 minutes ago and talking about Portis is all right. Nah, Portis to me, I mean, this is me. Portis is just as bad as Claudia. I like y'all. Oh, wow. There you go. You got, as much as do you have more? You got more action in <laughs> Damn. You got action today, Portis. Yeah, I know. You need I never, I Hold there, Jay, Jay Scholar. Hold on. You run out of dick counts. <laughs> <laughs> gotta go I mean, pick up I some more. Got a little bitty legs, <laughs> <laughs> got a little bitty hey, legs. Hey, you're just in time to play our game show. <laughs> 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 and I'm rolling up for this. So okay, I'm okay. Right. okay. Oh, what kind of weed you smoke? I like good weed. A match yeah. made in heaven. Can you talk about that? What the youngins call it around Jay, sit back for a second. We got questions for you, Pimpin. Jay, you've just tuned in to Reach Around Radio's Ratchet Dating Game. Yeah. You be ratchet. So since you're rolling up, uh, okay. what kind of grade are you rolling up right now? I am currently rolling up some kush right now. Oh, okay. And I, I don't, Portis, I'm sorry. I don't smoke blunts. We smoke, I smoke papers. That's okay. fine. We, That's OJ. Yeah, yeah. OJ. Okay, okay Jay, That's first fine. question. First question, Jay, first question. How many teeth do you have? 32 teeth. Oh, all right. He's in the running. Like right. Okay, okay. Oh, Claudia? Because it sounds cool. Now, Jay, you guys both like to smoke weed. Yeah. Say you had one last little bit left. Good enough for one long, good hit. Pinhead. Mm -hmm. Who gets it? Do you get it? Or do you pass it to a poetess? Well, what I would like to do is let poetess hit it and her give me a shotgun. Oh. I was I was just thinking that we are on the same page. I was just uh -oh. thinking going green, okay. Hey. cycling. Okay. Hey, points for you because I was thinking the same thing. Give a charge. Mm. We call it a charge. Now, right? He called it shotgun. I think shotgun. 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 All right. Okay. All right, big dog. This house going to go down. Hmm? You get over poor this house. Lights are off. She's not in the house yet, but she tell you go on and make yourself comfortable. Do you take right. off your clothes or you are sitting on the couch? She 
She said, well, I already know what time it is. If I already know what time it is, I'm going to go get comfortable to the Jordan short. <laughs> to the Jordan short. He is in Carolina. <laughs> you know what? Speedy, did you ever do that? Like, go over a chick's house and thought it was on and cracking and got butt naked and didn't? No, nah, because I don't want to get rejected like that. <laughs> I can't take rejection at all. That would be bad. Really? That's a bad one. That happened to me. You gonna take your shit off and see they, what? No, it didn't pour it. No, no, no. It's, I went over a guy's house. Oh. And what happened? And I just went in to use the bathroom, and I came out, and he was butt naked in his bed. Oh, like, Mike Tyson. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Herbie Love Boy. Uh, I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> He didn't roll no joint up or nothing. <laughs> no, he was just... Yeah, like, you got to smoke with her first. Come on, guys. Yeah, you got to smoke. Actually, just something to drink. Yeah, you want some Moscato? That's too anxious. Like, I'd rather, like, him wait and then me take his clothes off. Or... Okay, uh, Poetis, do you yeah. have a question for Jay right now? Um... Hmm. You ordering? What's going on? <laughs> Can I get a... Um... <laughs> I don't know. Jason is cool. Jay, so, Jay, Jay, Jay is cool. Come on, Porter, give me a good one. Give you a good one. Okay. Uh, how many dates before you go down on her? What? what? <laughs> no, now you can't hear us. <laughs> how many dates would it take before you would give her oral sex? I mean, if it's on and cracking and she's going to go down on me and bless me with that OG uh, talent she got. Oh, mm, <laughs> she do got talents, my brother. How do you know, Speedy? <laughs> definitely, definitely got to let her, uh, uh, I'm going to go first, and then once she get it popping, it's on. We, 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 we on. So you'll lick the monkey? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm talented. Nervous? Sound like you're a little nervous here, baby. <laughs> take, your, take your foot off the, off the gas pedal, baby. Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 my carburetor like Tito. <laughs> <laughs> he knows all the, he's a true Reach My Radio fan. Yeah, oh, we nice. appreciate it. Scholar, even. T-Dog is a trip, but man, he's cool. Man, man <laughs> you gotta be sure with T. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, shit. Oh, don't start, don't start. start. Don't start. start. <laughs> he beat you in a race, though. <laughs> 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 well, thank you, Jay. Thank you, Jay, Scholar. because we have Jason in New York, and we have Chris in Connecticut, and we have Jay in South Carolina. So we're going to let poets go home and sleep on you guys. <laughs> and we'll come back next week with an answer. Maybe you'll get a Skype account, <laughs> and you get to see these biddies <laughs> While we smoke blunts. Shake it on a screen near you. <laughs> While we blow the screen with smoke. We got another caller. We Thank have you, uh, Big L from New York. Big L. Welcome to the show, Big L. What up, what up, what up? Hey, hey, uh, hey. Hey, hey. Yeah, I'm a big fan of all y'all, man. I've been a fan since day one. R.I.P. SCC, Speedy's Comedy Corner. Thank you, wow. man. I appreciate that. Yo, I was a huge fan. Uh, yo, Pontus, uh, is your dad really in there? He was. He's in his probably in his office or he left already. You want to talk to him? Uh, uh, no, 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 no. I oh. just wanted to say I'm a big fan of the podcast uh, uh, he works on, uh, the Smiley and West, I think. Smiley and West po uh, podcast with uh, Terry Smiley and Corner West. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yep, yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and, uh, and uh, POTUS, I'm the one who plays you on Words with Friends. I've been beating you a little bit. Oh, oh hey, oh, hey, hey what's, what's, what's your screen name on there? Kigalio. To Gal uh, I think, didn't we play I Beat You? <laughs> no, 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 you've been me here and there, but I win about 8 out of 10. Hey, Big L, shut your mouth. You're on our game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you win 8 out of 10? You beat me that much? Yes, yeah, okay. pretty much. Okay. But, uh, yo, I, yo, I just wanted to say my one of my, my favorite TDP lines. What's that? Yo, one day, I think it was like Johnny Mac was uh, like, he was showing off about his, you know, his shoulders and shit. He was talking about how buff he is and all that. Yeah. So TDP said, yo, your arms are like Lou Ferrigno, but your, your legs, legs are like, like a, a pink, pink flamingo. flamingo. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, TDP is becoming <laughs> winning. No, because that was, that was the time we had, we had went to uh, Bowles across the street. Yes. And Spinny yeah. had brought that girl. Uh -huh. And she was like dumb as shit. <laughs> so I pulled Johnny Mac to the side. Hold on, pimp. Yeah. No, just let me tell the story. Which bitch was it? The girl that was talking <laughs> that crazy shit. So I pulled Johnny Mac to the side and I said, uh -huh. Johnny Mac, this bitch put the um and dumb. So then that Friday, he tried to say my shit on the air. So I'm like, oh, okay. I see how you get out. So that's why I really had to go at that dude like that. Yeah, 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 I don't blame you, man. Yeah, yeah. I, li I, yo, I died for like 10 minutes straight. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Big L. We appreciate, appreciate that, you uh, supporting the show. New York City. Oh, hey, Claudia, Claudia. Yes? What up, son? 
What up? Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> because I tell the I'm story. The, I'm the dude from New York who called you son in bed. You remember me? <laughs> yes. oh. what's, your, what's, your, uh, where's your accent from? What? Which, my, where's oh, your oh, accent? Oh, my accent. I'm from Africa, but I, I've been in New York for the past like 10 years. Yeah, what, part, okay. what part of Africa? I, I like you for three years in a month. <laughs> uh, I, I'm mixed up. I mean, I'm from Gabon and Rwanda. Gabbana and Rwanda. Yeah, I thought you was. Oh, t- so you a Tootsie? <laughs> yeah, 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 actually. Okay. Well, you I need to be killed. Uh, <laughs> Peter. Oh, <wow>. oh, <laughs> I thought he was a tick, tick, boom. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, he is, Peter. He fucking cheated on Wizard your friends. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know what's so funny? funny. Yeah. Saving, uh, I know what's so funny. I'm playing a robot. Oh. oh you, you are. Oh, man, your ass beat. You're playing some little kid in India. That's your plan. Easy ass words I'm beating you motherfuckers with. No. It's ridiculous. Abraham, over there. Shut up, Speedy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Big Al, for calling. Don't leave in. your backpack, no. Right, yo. when, Af- when an African tells you shut up or like a uh, Arab, it's like intimidating. Like, no, it's not. They mean that shit. Like, he said, shut up, Speedy. Like, he really meant that. Like, shut up, you might get beheaded. You know what I mean? Shut up, Speedy. <laughs> I like when they Big know. Al from New York. Thanks for the call. 323 It is Talent Thursday, but you know, we chopping it up. We only have one group come through. <laughs> Yeah, they heard the tech, technical studios in the hood in the now. Saint Eugene. <laughs> <laughs> I thought driving to the airport was fun. The talent was good. Though. Which which dumb bitch did I bring over to? Do you want to say that? Yes. Remember, what she looked like? Group, remind uh, me what she looked like. I can't remind, but it was that, that time to that. Oh, that that real light girl who looked. She looked white, but she was a she was a sister, but she just had that that like. She was a big. Her girl. color was no. She was she was thick. She was cool. Oh, I know oh, you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that time. Asia. And Asia. Asia yeah, was, I'm just going to put her Asia's, name out there. <laughs> Is that the one she's from the Midwest? She's another Virgo. Uh, Asia was from Oakland. No, she's from Oakland. I mean, like, real, she like, was, yeah, she's borderline. Weird. But she, you can tell she's a sister, but her color is just like. Yeah, she's, yeah. She, was, uh, she's, she had issues. She was homeless. And she had nowhere to stay, and I let her stay at my house. Mm. And everybody thought I was hitting it. I was like, nah, she needed somewhere to stay. Her boyfriend had put her and out. And you didn't hit it? No. Nah. She yeah. was saying some, like, crazy stuff, like, do you really believe that? Yeah, and if I, I took her to Fox House, and I know when it's bad, Fox went, uh, Speedy, who's this bitch? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I said, like, who are you talking about? This bitch right here that's in my room. Yeah. I was like, Asia, what the fuck you doing in there? I was talking to Jamie. He don't want to. She had got drunk. Oh, okay. She don't handle her liquor, liquor well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She got drunk. was like, I just was trying to ask him a question. He act like he can't talk to me. I was like. You gotta go now. Yeah, and but I drove her up there, and I said, had my, I think somebody took her home, cause she was, uh, she was crazy. Yeah, that one right there, she was, was borderline crazy. She was dumb, really. Yeah. She, she, was, she was just, if she got drunk, it was a wrap. But I didn't try to hit it all. She needed somewhere to live. Oh, that's nice of you. Yeah. You gave back to the fat community. She wasn't, she wasn't <laughs> big though. She, was, she was. Oh, she wasn't a real big one. Oh, oh, no. she was oh always, you know who they talking about? Yeah, you remember Asia? She played softball with us. Uh, Remember, she had she came with the booty shorts. Oh, when her short, shorts kept falling down. Yeah. And her whole ass out was out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pam style. <laughs> she had some pammies on. <laughs> that girl was like yeah. top. Hysterical. One she thing. had no strings in her shorts either. <laughs> What's this new trend? I remember got, that too. It's called broke. When she got drunk. Oh my goodness. Really? Oh man. What's the worst things you guys have done drunk? Uh well. I passed out Anybody? In, in Miami for two days. Oh, I, I know what I did. What'd you do? Suck some dick? I have a couple bad things, but I, one of them I can't tell. You suck dick? That's what you do? Hilarious. Is like, your daddy in there? I thought you guys say hello. hello. My daddy. I said hello. You suck dick. Yeah, what's the worst thing, things you guys have done? Like, you Boy, like the next day, like, damn, man. No, I, drunk, I drunk drove one time. Drunk drove? Yeah, I drunk drove. <laughs> one time? <laughs> it, was a, um, it was a linen party at San Dimas, out at the hot tubs and all that. You know jet skis. That, Come on, sweetie. I'm, I'm, I do this So we <laughs> with, out there With your bling bling On your pinky So we doing this You know The, the linen party thing So it was this Little European broad Who was working The hot tub thing mm-hmm. You know So I hollered at her For a minute She was like You know Give me the hook up But then That night we left And we was in Long Beach At the party Getting fucked up And then she called me mm. I'm stumbling And mumbling I, I get into the beast so I I'm on the freeway. I'm on the 710 trying to get to the 210, and I'm doing like a hundred and something, something. What? Drunk. I got to get there. I got 20 minutes. <laughs> her parents was racist and all that. I had to meet her at the corner. And, oh, it was. You hit? It was a beautiful night. You hit? <sighs> Speedy. European. <laughs> no, they mad now. She was, she was colder than. The other European? <laughs> you know they really mad right now. So that no, was like, I probably would have got out of jail yesterday from that shit right there. Because I was right. shit in the, the car. 
give you the story of uh, putting your mouth on it? We're talking about what we did when we were drunk. Just say speedy. what you did, girl. Yeah, I was drunk. Um, a friend of mine was visiting, Mm-mm. and Hooked we went up. bar hopping. Oh. And about we hit up like five bars, and each bar I had about three or four shots of Patron. <laughs> <laughs> so by the time we got back to the uh, to the room, oh, that was that time you talked. Hilarious! This is hilarious. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. <laughs> Yeah, what tell happened, that. yeah, what happened, B? She's like, Teeter. <laughs> <laughs> so we doing it, you know, getting oh, ready gosh. to do the damn thing, and this nigga came too fast, and I cussed him out. Poor it is. She came to me, Teeter, am I wrong for this? I was like, huh? <laughs> you can't cuss him out. He, you got to at least give him the second round. I was drunk. You and he never <laughs> forgave me for that. I apologized and everything. Because if I hadn't have been drunk, I wouldn't. Have, I wouldn't have reacted like that. So, but so I wanted to he, get you mine take off too. your clothes. You take <laughs> off. He take off his and oh shit. But Speedy, the funny part, she was telling me this. So she's like, Petita, I sent him a card. I emailed him, tell him I was sorry. Tita, and then this, she, the no, say? and then she fell in the pole. Then she said, Man, fuck that nigga. Put the blood on him. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga, I'm cool. Tita, he did the, me wrong. I didn't do him wrong. What did the card say? No, she was telling me that she got him a card, you know, a nice card to oh, apologize and send him an email. Yeah. And then she snapped in the pole. Man, fuck that. I, man, fuck you. He, he did me wrong. <laughs> Put the blood out in her hand. So when, when did he nut? Like, as soon as y'all got in the bed? We, when we was doing some foreplay. Oh, and foreplay. Foreplay. You a little foreplay. And All I and way. I and I cussed him out. Foreplay. That's why I remember you telling that story. So I didn't order no clam chowder. What? <laughs> Whose babies are these? I'm not watching them. <laughs> so, uh, he he, did what? needless to say, you know. Poor guy. So I was drunk Even stuff. when I came to his town, I hit him up. He wouldn't hit me back. He's like, oh, no, nah, I'm quick job right done. now. I got to get done. it together. He got a bus with off of his car. Shout out right to uh, Don in Arizona. Wow. <laughs> 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 Watch out for that bus. Wow. Love it, I love it, I love it. Give us your uh, Claudia. <laughs> I have so many. I'm like, which one should I tell? The broken finger concussion story? Uh, uh, okay, well, I went to Vegas with two of my girls. One of them is no longer with us, actually. Sorry to hear that. But um, it's like my first time hanging out with her. So we go, we go to Vegas, and we like go in like we're at Tao we're like at this dinner table with like some very very big celebrities right, right? right. like it was like the hangover we just kept running into people it wasn't gotcha. planned it was like one of those nights like man that night was the shit I wish I could remember all of it though okay. and we went to the club and like we were holding up Ace of Spades bottles and mm. Jay-Z and Diddy everybody was there like, at our, we were all at, that ta- at their table for those gotcha. who don't know how much Ace of Spades bottle costs. I don't know it's a lot of money I think they're like $1,500 each yeah. I think they're like, that's in the streets in the streets street. so in the club that's like they're thousands of dollars so anyways we're like we're doing it up right and he, he Jay Z wanted all the girls, everybody to have like eight spades bottles, and he was being totally, right. he was not trying to get anybody. Mm-hmm. I have to say that. Party. He just was like everybody, all the fly chicks hold the bottles, like so it just looks good. It's a good look. Yeah. So I'm really take. I feel like I'm in a music video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking it to take it to the head. The bottles upside down, and at one point, I'm a lightweight. I just sat down with everybody's feet like this, my head down. So my girls, they were like, we gotta take her to the room. Mm-hmm. I don't remember making it to the room, but they said I was so arrogant. Like I was like. I had a white dress on. I had spots on my dress. I was, I'm, still, I'm still the shit with spots on my dress. Bitches can't see me. I can barely see myself. Like I was just like talking shit, right? So anyways, I get to the room. I don't remember any of this. The next day, I wake up. One of my friends in the bed with me, the girl, right? Like we shared the bed. All I have is a thong on and my ass hurt. Slow down. <laughs> oh Slow my down. God. Hey, different music bed, please. Different music bed, please. <laughs> I was going to go to sleep on the no. story a minute ago. Hold on, hold on, uh, hold on, hold on. Your ass is hurt. Because I, I, I had a thong on. It was like chasing. No, I don't get hurt about that. No. So anyway, I, I look at my girl and I go, what the fuck did you guys do to me? Like, I don't change in front of my friends. Right. Like, I'm not one of those friends that gets naked in front of their but girls. this time, somebody. So I'm like, who took my dress off? My diamond chain was off. Ass. I was just like, what the hell happened to me? So we like recreate, like we went back and did some CSI shit. So I guess when we got back to the room, I must have been like hot or something, just like threw everything off because my, my dress was in the was bathroom. On them bath socks. Right, my diamond. I chain, <laughs> my chain was by the toilet. Like it More fell out. I just left it there. Like you could tell I just took my hair. Like, Why was, was your ass hurting? 
because I had a thong on. If, if it was like it was too small, it like really rubs against your um, tailbone. But this is such. I always like like put that in her face. I like, throw that in her face. Like, why okay. was my butt So, anyways, it had nothing to do with her. It was just kind of. But yeah, that was one of my drunk stories. But I, I have, have a drink. lot of Claudia drunk stories. <laughs> you do. You get really ratchet, and you will cuss oh. anybody. You guys remember her birthday? Hello, we all went to the court. I was in the car. Yeah, and then she does. She left and went and slept in the car yeah. in front of the court. Oh, I'm like, you cannot sleep in the car on yeah. Adams and whatever. <laughs> Hardcore. Are you serious? <laughs> and let me tell you, we went to the mall. She, she, this white man walking by. He was like, hey. She was like, hey. You got a big dick. <laughs> the man no. was like, was oh my, Papa was with us. I don't know you're talking I about. I was like, and then we, I was like, um, we have people waiting at the court. She's like, fuck them. How about you guys? <laughs> hey, fuck man. them. They can wait. I don't remember none of Yeah, she gets <laughs> really, really um, rambunctious. Jeremy said it. <laughs> what? Oh, I thought Jeremy said it. Okay, I won't. <laughs> anyway. All right, that was, that was very funny. But being that you <laughs> He are said that's very opera. funny that she said, fuck them. They can wait. Yeah. Being that you're <laughs> alcoholic. You are listening to the story. Yeah, you're <laughs> alcoholic. <laughs> It's been a great show. <laughs> All right. Shout out to the one Cortis, talent that came through. <laughs> Cortis gave us a, gave me a kick. It's been a great show. <laughs> yes, ahead, it bro. has. What you doing this weekend? I am going to uh, work on my book. I said I was going to take off from here and work on my book. And um, The book I is called b- How to Roll a Joint <laughs> While You're Drunk. No, it's not. And I'm going to go bike riding. I got a bike rack from my car. Oh, that's so. right. You said it came today. Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, so, you. so you still don't have a seat for it though, right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want no seat. Just give me the rack. <laughs> no, me and Pam living? were talking about there's this website called homeaway.com and instead of like renting a hotel, you can rent houses. So I was thinking that maybe someday soon that all of us could get a house in Malibu for the weekend and just while out. Go get some bite. Yeah, yeah let's do it. It, it's it's actually um, less than getting a hotel there. So. Pick a day. Would you guys bring dates or just us? Just us and maybe a few friends. That know. The close ones. What's a few? Why why you look at me like that, Speedy? Oh, never mind. I mess you up. No Speedy, no, no hoes. Sorry. Like Pringles, you can't just have just one. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just letting you know, Pam. If I'm in somewhere with you. Oh shit! Can we see another kiss? No, we that have was Christ- spontaneous. But we have the Christian in stu- the studio. I'm going to beat that. I already did that. You no, just did kidding. your Tourette's in. Oh, 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 no. 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 Yeah. Hey, so you guys, check no, this shit. out. Um, Dick Holmes here? Dick Holmes? Are you oh, Christmas? Let me make sure I get this out. Hold on, Dick Holmes is here. Right. She christened, oh, yes? oh, that's, she christened the studio. No, I didn't. You fucked at the studio? What, what, no, what's on I the table? Didn't. I'm going to tell you. Oh, it's no, the spot right I here. It's the spot right here. It's not true. Lies. All uh, lies. This weekend look like I'm going to be here because Marshawn Lynch's mom didn't hit me back. So, like, I'll be, be here this week. Next weekend, what? I'm in Toledo, Ohio with Brian McKnight. We're doing a show in oh. Toledo, Ohio. Oh. And I'm in Oakland with Coca Brown. We're at the Tommy T's. And there's, uh, there's a lot of sororities going to be in town that weekend. Sororities. Sororities. Who got sororities? Sororities. <laughs> and don't forget, you can catch us back here Monday. We, we're we actually going to stick to the two days a week. No Wednesdays. We're going to stick to Monday and Thursday. We bit off more than we could chew? <clears throat> huh? We bit off more than we could chew? It's just that we need to graduate to that, I think, a little bit. And yeah, we ain't sold enough t-shirts yet. Yeah. <laughs> if y'all want us to be on three times a week, buy up all the t-shirts. Also, be sure to check out on Tuesday the Young Guns of Comedy uh, from 7 to 9. Young comics, talented. They did a very good debut show here. And you can hear them on RMC on air on uh, Ustream. So check us out Tuesday at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. <laughs> Always is breaking down like a motherfucker. Yeah, he done turned off the tires. <laughs> he has a gig. Um, yeah, he has get a out gig. Here. It seems like you're getting uh, more busy. Yeah. Good for you. you yeah, yeah. There. So be sure to follow me on Twitter, uh, so Instagram, what? and Facebook under OG Poetess. And join our, if you like the show, join our uh, Facebook group page, Team RAR, or join us on Facebook under Reach Around Radio. We got that back. We're going to be building that up this week. Oh, we, so. we need new people to go to that page because we lost one of our pages. Yes. Uh, one page is gone. The one page is gone, but I bought it back. Reach oh, you around did? You brought radio. it back. Yeah. Reach yeah. around That's radio. Right. Hey, cool. There's no pictures or anything up yet, but we're going to be Reach Around Radio. That's our going to be our official page. And then our group Ratchet page, <laughs> <laughs> Team RAR. And we love you guys on that page. Thanks for riding with us. And also follow us on Twitter at RAR Official One. See you Monday. Uh, Wait, what about everybody Damn, we can't else? Say that. You kick me, motherfucker. I didn't touch you, Speedy. <laughs> you keep grabbing my leg. You a damn lie. That ain't my leg either. Go ahead, Claudia. <sighs> 
Uh, follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Claudia Jordan and Facebook, just Claudia Jordan. And uh, this weekend, just laying low, no plans, actually. I'll come through. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Teeter. I'm good. Hilarious. That's how she does it. She puts a smile. I'm good. Oh, thank you. good. Hey, make sure you hit our Reach Around Radio number up, y'all. 818-646-7385. That's the number you leave a message on. She let me tell a story, y'all. My bad. I'll tell it. <laughs> so I'll leave like- us your drunken weekend calls. <laughs> whatever, wherever you at the store whatever leave your calls on there so we can put it in the mix with DJ Always that's always in your ear on Twitter give that number again <clears throat> that's 818-646-7385 that is the Reach Around Radio Gmail number so make sure you leave a message and everything will be A-OK you can follow me TDP Mr. 123 Knox Baby that's Facebooks and Twitter and shout out to the young brother in uh in, in Arizona who come too quick <laughs> <laughs> Poor Don. Don. So sorry dog I give you a second chance bro nah wow <laughs> <laughs> okay Tina this is what happened <laughs> we'll see you guys job. Monday thank always. you Tim thank Mammy you Pam. always Donnie Don and our Lee. whole entire and, my, and uh, Kiara and uh, LA Mike LA thanks Mike. y'all deuces right